What's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix um, that Elden Ring is crashing or freezing in some way. So be sure to stick until the end. I will fucking explain you how to do that. So um, yeah guys, before I started right into the video, I just wanted you guys to know, let you guys know that I would really, really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, comment or a subscription right onto my channel. It would really help me out growing out my YouTube channel, supporting my project YouTube. So yeah, guys, um, subscribing is free for you and would be a massive support for me. Be sure to hit the subscribe button. I will thank you for that and let's get right started. So the first thing you want to basically do is uh, go to your task bar, make a right click and open up your task manager. Once this opens up, you can basically go to background processes and be sure to Trust me, just close every single program application that is running in the background and as application that has nothing to do with um, Elden Ring. Because in some cases there are programs that avoid um, Elden Ring to run or uh, cause them or cause Elden Ring to crash. So just be sure to uh, close every single program that has nothing to do with uh, Elden Ring. The next thing you want to basically do for the same reason is going to start up and disable every single program you don't really need um, to play. Um, yeah, Elden Ring. Then you can basically close your task manager and uh, go afterwards, you can basically go to your desktop, make a right click, display settings. And uh, now you're when you are at display, you can basically scroll down and be sure to you using your or the right monitor if you, if you have more than one. And go to scale and layout where you should basically go to 100%. And as display resolution, you should basically use the resolution that uh, you have natively or using as native resolution in Elden Ring. You know, once you check that, you can basically close this also again. And the next thing you want to do is basically um, navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen. Go to your Windows symbol, go to settings. Once this opens up, this um, window here pops up, you just go to... Um, updates and security and be sure that you're having the latest version of Windows because so you can basically come along with new upcoming updates from Windows. The same thing is for your graphics card. If you have AMD or Nvidia, just be sure to download the latest version of the update or the latest version of your graphics card uh, in order to maintain the per perfect performance. And yeah, guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right onto my channel. It will really help me out. I'll thank you for that, guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.